Hey there, I am Sarah, co-founder of the Well Together Collective, and I'm so pumped that you are here watching this video. Ellie and I got to talking about the pressure that sometimes comes along with working in the wellness space. This idea that just because we work and engage in this type of work that we always have it together. And if you're watching this video, you and I both know that that could not be farther from the truth. So we created this space, the Well Together Collective, because we needed it and it didn't exist. So we are all busy women living multifaceted lives. And while we're trying to make all of the pieces work, we sometimes forget to fill our own cups. And we know that when we're not taking care of ourselves in mind, in body, in soul, it can negatively impact our work, the people that we love and everything else around us. So this space is about really simplifying that, really streamlining it, and just providing a framework for you to come as you are on the day-to-day, -day, on the week-to-week, -week, pull what you need, leave what you don't, and stay connected with a group of like-minded women that are also doing the same. So here's a little bit about what you'll find inside. We know that movement and nutrition, fueling our bodies is so important. So we've included a uh, search engine with over 250 plant-centered, allergen-friendly recipes. We'll be making recipe suggestions on the week-to-week, -week, or you can just use that search engine feature to search for what your body is needing or craving. Our movement philosophy is simple. It's about taking the pressure off of exercise or movement, needing to look a certain way or needing to be perfect. Our mind and soul component is so powerful and truly transformative. Every week we'll be offering curated guided meditations or journal prompts. These are designed to keep us in a state of reflection and flow. We'll also be offering a book series. Every six weeks we'll offer a new book title and before you say, Sarah, I can't believe that you're asking me to add a book onto my already busy, packed schedule. We invite you to maybe consider picking up or downloading the audio version, listening to that in your car while you drive, while you fold laundry. Think about how you compare a mindful activity with a mindless activity. We'll also host weekly challenges and we'll have an accountability component around this in our online community. These are the things that we do or don't do, the little things that are seemingly insignificant on the day to day that we know make a really big impact. They're things like getting enough water, being aware of taking a consistent break in the middle of the day to take a sip of fresh air or to feed yourself lunch, to check in with yourself while you're sitting at your desk. Am I sitting tall or am I curled down into my keyboard like this? These are the things that if we don't really think about them, it's easy to lose awareness around that. The part that ties all of this together is our sisterhood and community. So if you haven't already, take a moment to join, create a profile for our online community. It just takes about five minutes. Pop your picture in there, come in and say hello, introduce yourself, share us a little bit about who you are, what brings you to the Well Together Collective, share a little bit about the important people in your life and the important work that you do in the world. The final layer is our monthly group coaching calls. Ellie is going to lead these, I will be co-leading, and it's such a powerful place to come and just be supported, stay connected, ask questions, grow and learn from one another. Hi, I'm Ellie, the other co-founder of the Well Together Collective, and I could not be more thrilled to welcome you today. Congratulations on taking this extremely important and monumental step towards caring for yourself, caring for everything that you have inside, reinvigorating your body, your mind, your soul, your gifts, so that you can continue to share them externally. Uh, we really wanna remind you today to take a second to celebrate yourself. Maybe put your hand on your heart and close your eyes and just say thank you. Thank you for making this decision. Thank you for finding support and for finding a community that is supportive of what I'm needing. Tell yourself that. It's so important to do that because we are also celebrating you and it is extra rich when we can celebrate ourselves and celebrate everybody else that's in the group. 
If you haven't gotten into the community yet, make sure to get in there and say hi. And lastly, it's just been on my heart to say, no matter where you've been, no matter what your journey has looked like up until now, no matter how you're feeling about yourself or your work or anything, your mind, body, soul at the moment, it doesn't matter. We're all coming in perfectly to this to continue on our journeys together. We're here to support you in your good moments, your bad, there is zero power the skeletons in the closet have zero power here and we're really excited to do this imperfectly and just show up exactly as we are and share authentically and cheer each other on for everything that we are doing to support ourselves and others good days and bad days alike so i can't wait to say hi to you all in the community and make sure to jump in there like i said if you haven't and we are excited for you to explore everything that we've created for you inside